Suppose I have a deep learning model which predicts on this x-ray that the cancer region is of this shape. But the radiologist creates this shape for the area of tumor. So the problem is how do we compare the shape that is created by the radiologist versus the shape which is created by a deep learning model. In these kind of problems, there are various metrics used to compare the two shapes. The most commonly used ones are dice score and jacquard score. However, there is another metric known as Hausdorff distance, which is very robust. Today we are going to see how Hausdorff distance works and how do we calculate it. If we state that HD between two figures is 3 mm, it means that we can pick any point in shape A and find the distance to its nearest point in shape B and it will not be more than 3 mm. This can be understood by the following algorithm used to calculate HD. It has been beautifully explained in the McGill University web Side. So any shape is basically a set of points or a collection of points. For simplicity, we will consider two points in set A and three points in set B. The points in set A are A1 and A2 and B1, B2, B3 in set B. From set A, we pick point A1 first and then calculate the distances to all the points in set B that is B1, B2 and B3 and then we keep the shortest distance out of all three. We repeat this process for point A2 and then find the distances between A2 and B1, B2, B3 and then we keep the shortest distance out of all three. Once we have the collection of all the shortest distances between points in set A and points in set B, then finally we find the largest out of all those distances and this distance is known as the Hausdorff distance. Hausdorff distance is considered to be more robust than dice score and jacquard score because it is not as sensitive to small changes in the boundary of the sets. However, calculating HD can be computationally heavy and especially for high dimensional data. These videos take a long time to create, so please like and subscribe to support us. If you want to see the code implementation of Hausdorff distance, check out this video. If you have any doubts, Please let us know in the comments below.